Po'boy Special here with a dark diamond sight for a Glock. We're going to show you just how quick and easy it is to install this thing so anybody can do it. Alright, the first thing you need to do is choose a color for your front sight. And going from left to right, you have the coral, the yellow, the aqua, and the green. Everything you will need for installation comes in the package. You have your front sight tool, the Allen wrench, all the colored sights, your four different colored shims, your dark diamond rear sight, your front sight base, and the screw that goes into the front sight. All right, let's get started with the installation. I chose the Aqua and took the others and just placed them to the side because I'm not going to need them for right now. And here is the aqua site and there is the screw that goes into the bottom of it. All right next we have the base for the front site. It just pushes on right where the front sight goes there at the front of the slot. You just push it down and it's that easy and it goes into that little hole. Push it down to where it's taut and it doesn't move. Right here we have the rear sight along with the shim. I set the shim on top of it so you could see it because it's kind of a clear or an opaque shim and it's really hard to see. So I put it against the black background. You simply insert that into the front sight base and I'm just using the Allen wrench just to tap it up to where the holes align with each other. Then you take the front sight with the color of your choice. And with the slope going back toward the shooter. You simply align it and put the rails in it and slide it right in. Right next you take the front sight tool which is provided and at the open end there you place the hexagonal shape end of the screw into the front side tool like such. Alright, the way I did this is I held the front sight with one hand and with the other using the front sight tool to gently screw in that screw in the bottom there of the front sight. And you just want it hand tight and if this is the one you're going to choose for good you might want to use some blue Loctite after you've sighted in and you're happy with the results. Once again, do not over tighten it, just hand tighten it and it will not move and that will be sufficient. And your front side is now installed. All right, you take the rear sight and you slide it in the grooves and tap it in. And once you have it tapped in, you straighten it to your liking, make sure it's straight, and that's it. 
Right next, you'll take the Allen wrench provided, and you will tighten down the little screw at the top of that rear sight. And once you do, start tightening it. You don't want to over tighten it or damage it in any way. You just want it pretty snug. And once again, once you get it to exactly where you want and lined up, you can use blue Loctite on this screw and it will keep it in place very, very, very well. And there you are. That's it. Your rear sight is now installed. Quick and easy installation complete. Now all you have to do is put the weapon back together and you are ready to shoot. Alright, this installation was done on a Glock 23, but it applies to any Glock that you have. And, as always, you saw it here on the Po' Boy Special Channel.